Hi, this is a video to demonstrate how to create a multi-layer thin structure. We're going to make the, my layers rectangular, define the center, and drag. You can specify, say, 25 by 55 millimeters, and I can start pulling them. You can specify a distance, so I'm going to say 1 millimeter. That's one layer. When we want to do a multi-layer structure, there are a few options. The easiest way is to you can you can do it a couple of ways. One is select the surface. I can copy and paste that surface. And as you can see now, there's a surface there. I can pull that up by one millimeter. Let's pull the surface up by one millimeter. And then we have the surface underneath. So we can do this operation again. So we can do a copy and paste and put in one millimeter. Uh, when things are visible and they're all touching each other, they get merged together. So you can undo it. You need to hide these surfaces. Put in one millimeter, and that shows another one. Or you can put these surfaces into separate components move each to a new component. When different components are touching, they, don't, they do not get merged together. So if I do a copy and paste here, and I put in one millimeter, it'll... oftentimes I like to move things into new components. The other option is we can select a body and move this body upwards. You can do a, create a pattern. I think there's an option to copy. The option to copy is hold down shift and drag. The option to copy is to control and drag. You can put one, uh, one millimeter here. Or hold down the control key and drag. That, like that as well. Just keep dragging more. Once you have, uh, let's, let's actually give it a big one. Once you have a stack like this, in order to make the mesh conformal, go to share topology and select share. This is ensure that you have a conformal mesh. That's a quick demonstration of how to create a stack geometry with multiple layers and how to ensure that they're meshed conformally in ANSYS. Thank you.